we could make pinholes using perhaps the, uh, the sick bag that's in the seats provided. So if you make a, re a reasonably generous pinhole and hold it oh, up I've to the window, it perpendicular to the rays of the sun. That's the end now. Get your sick bag, G. Below, you see a beautiful pinhole. image of the sun uh, the with, the, with a large bite taken out of it. Reversed, of course. Oh no, you see, we're being a bit, bit foolhardy here. I've just torn that, I've just torn that in half, and I might need it. That was very foolish. Well, I'm sorry, but you know, you can't have our... It's like uh, a slice of melon lying down and getting smaller by the minute. Oh, wow! Oh, that's, that is actually quite incredible. Did you see it? Yes. Oh, well done, Mum. Gene, you're virtually on it, look. You're virtually up there, look. It's amazing, isn't it? The people on the left side of the bed should be looking out for the shadow. With thick cloud gathering beneath and obscuring any sight from the ground, the Eclipse flight must climb to 35,000 feet for a clear view. We're all getting quite excited, though. How did you come here today? By my, by my car. By your car? Yeah. Where's your car now? There, in the outside. Whereabouts in the outside? Okay. It's in the car park, is it? Okay, Jack. Right, could you give me details of your car, please? Nissan. What sort of Nissan? Primera. Primera? Yeah. Right, and you say you're not a cab driver? Uh, when? Uh, Why don't you tell me the truth? Actually, I'm coming, just, you know, I'm just waiting to pass my time in here. Okay. Right, I have no reason to be at the airport today. I'm okay. requesting you to leave. Okay. Under the bylaws, you must not return within 24 hours or you'll be in contravention of the bylaws, all right? Okay. To come to the airport, okay. you need to be working here, you okay. need to be a passenger, okay. you need to be meeting a named passenger, which right. I didn't believe the story you gave me, okay. right? You've got no reason to be here. All right. Okay? All right. Off you go. Right, I just fill out what we call an ejectment slip and make a little entrance, um, an entry on the criminal intelligence computer, and I'll pass the details on to the taxi information desk so they recognise them in future. You're panicking so much that you're making me panicking now. Monica Bentley wants to give her granddaughter in Los Angeles a video. With only 35 minutes before boarding, it may not be such a good idea. I've got 10 hours to relax afterwards. Well, if you get in the plane. What do you mean? <laughs> Stop that. <laughs> Oh, yes, of course. Yes, that's right. Okay, no problem. Thanks a lot. No problem. No, I'm pretty fine. <laughs> They're holding the plane for me. Yeah, <laughs> that's what she said. Yeah? No, 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 no. comes down to this, up some steps. One of nature's great sights is now just minutes away. So, where did you watch the eclipse? Now, outside the porter cabin. <laughs> Can you actually see the, the sun through that? Can you actually see the... No, 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 no. All right. This is a monkey with a computer, look. <laughs> Which end do you look through? Oh, yeah. Oh, God, look at that. Yeah. Yeah, it's just... Yeah, you can't, you just glare, that's all you can see, isn't it? But it's, I mean, the light's really eerie, it is very, um, very weird, and the temperature's gone down as well. So it's, uh, it's definitely a strangeness about the place. Well, it's all just about to go. Yeah. We can wait for the plague of locusts and the uh, rats and everything else to come out and start playing. Totality <laughs> expected uh, about six minutes from now. Six minutes to go. It's getting quite eerie, Gene. Getting a bit like Tales of the Unexpected <laughs> on here. <laughs> uh, it is, isn't it? Oh, wow, look at that. Can you see that all right, mate? Thank you. Actually, it's better to be small than to be big and fat like me, because I can hardly see. Oh, look at that. 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 Look at that when, in a split second, a loved one can be lost. You've lost your family? Come, what's your name? Noor. Noor? And what's your surname? Aslam. Noor Aslam. 
my colleague here, he's going to go over and he's going to put a call out for you, and you're going to wait here with me, all right? And that anybody who's got you, Noor Aslam, is going to come to the information desk, and then my friend's going to bring them over here. All right? You don't recognize anyone around here? No? Could you put a tannoy out for his, um... Yeah. Can you do that, please? Yes, certainly. Who have you come to meet today? My friend and my dad and my grandma. And your grandma? Where, where are they coming from? Pakistan. Pakistan. Can you recognize anybody around here yet? No. There's so many people here, aren't there? Ooh, we've got a lot of people here. Corinne is looking for a speedy route through. Actually, I don't need to pass through here, do I? Let me check something. But finds her way barred by airport security. Hi. No. Why not? I don't know, but I feel you later. Oh, come on. Why? What? Well, I'm with this lady. We're going down to your shop down uh, uh, Disney. Yeah, we we can I pass through and find you, people? Go, go, go to the middle. Yeah. Go down the middle bar. Yeah. Okay, you can go to the front there. Okay, okay. marvellous. Okay, Thanks a lot. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. There we go, madam. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Won't be long. It's getting much, much dimmer now. There's very little left of the sun. Isn't that amazing, Jean? 35,000 feet above the west of England, and the moon makes its final path across the sun. It's getting, it's getting a bit like night time. Oh, so what can you see then, Gary? Uh, just, it's getting, it seems to be getting smaller on the edges, uh, from the edges, you know, it's contracting quite slowly. That's totality. Oh my lord, that is really incredible, isn't it? Can you see, Jade? It's just like a glow, isn't it? It's amazing. A load of people sitting in the bus station, they're totally nonplussed by the whole thing. <laughs> Keep looking at their watches for the bus, that's all. Lost boy, age of seven, answering to the name of Noor Aslam. Please contact the airport information desk immediately. What we'll do is we'll walk over to the information desk, all right? And hopefully the people we've called for will come there. Do they speak English, the people you're with? All right, okay. Let's go over to the information desk and have a look. Come on. Don't you lose me, will you? Let's wait here. You keep looking round. See if you recognise anyone, OK? All right. Noor Aslam. Is there anyone you know? No? Don't cry, dude. But my name's getting nervous right now. <laughs> no, she wants to, to get back, you know. Well, it's just for a little coffee, didn't we? Yeah, I just, just um, sacrificed the coffee. <laughs> It's just going to be on the left hand side. I highly appreciate this, my granddaughter. She will. Please tell her. <laughs> Sorry. Marvellous. Corrine's customers have never missed a flight. To keep her 100% record, they must catch the next bus back oh, to Terminal 3. Oh, no, what am I doing? That's done this way. Oh, we'll go and see if we can find some proper work to do now, I think. The Sanders we'll any, lights. See if we find any stories. Yeah. This isn't one. No one's jumped, I'll take it. No? No one's jumped. No one's jumped, no, no druids. No, uh, no rats, no locusts, nothing. Another day at the office, mate. Yeah. So, we have to post ourselves there. Congratulations, everyone. Well done. Yeah. 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 So, congratulations, everybody. It's something you can certainly tell your friends and your grandchildren, I'm sure you'll all remember for a very long time. 
What are that? you crying for? It's emotional, isn't it? Somebody said to me that there's going to be someone on the plane that's going to get really emotional. And a lady down.